beef steak tomato that's heavy, that's large, that's not seedy, that's meaty. The pink is a little bit more mild and very pretty. And then you have the traditional red. So if you're someone who makes sauce or gravy, um, you make, um, you know, a caprese salad, you make salsa, whatever it is, you make a tomato pie like I make, M89786, oh, pizza. For those of you who have a pizza, an oven, pizza oven, that would be delicious. $29.99, these are on sale, even this time of the year. These will ship right out to you. Four easy pays at $7.50, so if you wanna go ahead and buy a second set, go ahead and do that. As I said, one year when my dad was, you know, with us and he was more elderly, um, I sent him these tomato plants so that they didn't have to go anywhere, my mom and dad, so they could put, because I got them a box, like a garden box in the back. You can put these in your veg truck if you want to. You can put them in a big pot because they grow in containers. There is an auto delivery option. That's how popular these have been. And with the auto delivery, the nice thing is we'll ship these out right away and then next year when it's appropriate in your time of the or in your area of the country I should say the appropriate time you'll still hold on to the sale price whether we have it at a sale price again or not all right enough about me pink tomato red tomato and you're going to be growing two whole plants worth and they're pretty fast performers aren't they they are. You're going to be picking and eating these wonderful, juicy, sweet tomatoes in about 45 to 50 days from the time of planting. And it's never been easier because now you don't need a yard or a garden space, Pat. You can grow these in containers on your deck. These are compact. That means they've been bred to be only about two and a half feet tall, but they're going to have the yield of those big, big plants that you were talking about before. Mm -hmm. And these are unique because you are getting beefsteak plants on the patio, but you're getting red and pink, two of each, which is very special. I love and that look you how gave juicy two that of is. Each. Yeah, there's nothing like a beefsteak tomato, right? On your Rostelli burger, you know, and your caprese salad. It just it's so gorgeous and juicy and, and yes and you're going to be picking and eating these right in the middle of the summertime near a lot of tomato plants you got to wait 80 to 100 mm -hmm. days before you can harvest this is 45 to 50 so we've cut that work in half and that's what's so awesome about this collection because we want to have our homegrown tomatoes in the summer we don't want to wait until summer is almost over which is most tomatoes so, oh, here, Court's coming out here to eat. We did make some <laughs> tomato sandwiches with our uh, microgreens. Yeah, put a little microgreens on mine. Definitely. Yeah, I there love them. So these tomatoes are tastier. Um, they're easier. They're more. You get more. And they're simply the best. Oh. And they're quicker, too. Yeah, I mean, you're going to have an excess, a surplus. Mm. Learn to jar it, can it, mm. Mm. maybe learn how to give away some of your hard-grown tomato, mm. uh, easy-grown tomatoes. But let's talk about the flavor, Pat, because, uh -huh. you mm. know, tomatoes at the grocery store are empty of flavor, mm. and as far as I think, nutrition, too. What you're growing, you know what went into them. You know you're picking it fresh and ripe the day that you're eating it. There's not going to be a tomato like this in your entire year. And if you get the auto delivery, you're going to have them next year locking the same price. But what I love about this collection is these are the plants that you're getting. Look how healthy these are, okay? These likely will have one or two flowers on them when, right out of the box. Mm. But we are growing these from seed. We've already grown them for mm -hmm. some time. So by the time you get them home... You're going to be eating these in about seven to eight weeks tops. They're the best. They're so tasty, yep. so delicious, so easy in containers. And don't you think this is like the place to start? I know Terry is going to, last year I talked to her in a veg truck, and so she's, and her mom and dad are with her now, so they're going to do a full-blown garden for her family. You know, that made her sandwich that we all grew up with, with white yep. bread and mayo and throw this on i mean these are so good i could see somebody just going out there maybe not this one but taking this and eating it like it's an apple mm, um, my producer right. <laughs> carrie needs to know how long does she have to wait once she puts these tomato plants in to get this gorgeous tomato 
Yeah, only 45 to 50 days. It's one of the, it is Not probably 90. the fastest fruiting uh, beefsteak on the planet. And now you can huh. grow these in containers like this. Yes. You know, traditional beefsteaks, you had to have a yard, you had to have a lot of space. Now you're going to take that little starter, pop it in a container. You could even do two if you wanted to in a container this size, grow it right on your deck. Okay, they do like full sun. They do like a decent amount of water, but you know what? That's easy because you're not walking out with the hose. Mm -hmm. You're just right there. You open your back door right on the deck, pour the water in. You're good to go. And, you know, when we talk about growing vegetables, yes, tomatoes are the best first introduction because they're so easy. Yes. But this is even better now because, you know, a lot of times tomatoes get real big. You need those heavy cages. Mm -hmm. You're thinking, oh, you know, what am I doing? They're falling over. None of that's going to happen. They only get about two and a half feet tall. Let's look at the images because the images are going to show you what these look oh, like perfect. in the garden. Now, yeah, there's the, the red pink. and the pink side by side. You know, the pink a little bit more sweeter, a little less tart, but both, you know, such a perfect, crisp and fresh tomato flavor. There they are again, side by side. They're each about, you know, at least 16 ounces, if not more. Now, there is the the plant on the right in a container full size you know that's only two and a half feet tall but you've got over 30 tomatoes on that one plant so you get the yield of the big plants on a smaller sized uh no more dimension. dry burgers if you put these slices of uh patio uh, yep. beefsteaks on them yeah. i'm telling you Look it takes a burger if you overcook a burger don't worry no one's gonna notice just put a big slice of tomatoes <laughs> uh -huh. your Estelli's burgers i have to tell everybody fewer than 750 to go around if you are like me and you ordered the cherry tomatoes from Roberta's, order these along with it because, oh, yeah. you know, tomato season, that's summer. That's summer. And there's so <laughs> many recipes and goodness and it just, it's a world different when you're the person who has that opportunity to watch these grow. Mm, they're and Pat, so good. Also, I would recommend picking up the lavender and the marigold yep. okay. to go with. because you want all those tomato flowers to pollinate so you assure a successful crop of tomatoes this, this year. You got it. <laughs> Items recently on air. Um, we need our fig plant. We need to grow the micro greens. Mm. Challenge yourself. Grow your yep. own olives. I mean, the bananas, the ornamental bananas will just grow so we feel like we're in our tropics, even if all we did was have a blow-up pool. It's all good. Thank you, thank you to you. Thank you. Pat, your oh, joy. We Thanks. I absolutely adore and love you. Thank you very, very much. Thanks for keeping me company because the beautiful Julia is coming up. Julia, do you want one of these? I do. Okay. I, I heard Listen. you earlier. I am that person who could yeah. eat a tomato like an apple. Yeah, me too. Can you eat this? Okay. This is edible? Here. Yeah. Cheers. Totally. Happy Cheers. Gardening. All right. Mm. With the microgreens. Oh. Oh. Good, right? Oh, heaven. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's delicious. Oh, thank you very much. <laughs>